21st February and I give you some quick information from Tashkent. First of all, I should sure tell that there is lots of construction being carried out in Tashkent. One of them is underground train construction. The first problem is about that. Good morning. As you see, I am standing just in front of underground train. It is expected to be commissioned in 2021 to the public. In order to make the city more modern, train line is bit bit on the ground. That makes that makes long distance check more much closer for local people and guests. For other city, it is Mukhtar Makamodar special for BBC. Uh, to learn something, you have to be the best teacher who shows the right way. First of all, you need to choose right education center, which support which such teachers for law and program is about them. Good morning, you know there are many education centers in Tashkent, but you all of them are able to respond to the feeling of education center. Now first, we investigate famous one which is called Target. I am Mr. I am Mr. Oz oh, from BBC News. Can can you give a little bit information about Target? Good morning. Welcome to Target Education Center. I am the head manager here. We have five branches in Tashkent. This branch we are studying is studied in Sergeli district. Target is not specialized only for learning languages, but also preparation for school, mental arithmetics and maths. Moreover, if you are interested in studying abroad or job recommend, just contact with us. Now we make conversation with students. Good morning. What's your name? Hi, my name is Shabalor Shamalov. Tell me about your teacher. I'm learning English. My teacher is Miss Donald, who is the best teacher I have ever seen. She can manage to build a friendly atmosphere because uh, every lesson she can prepares for uh, every lesson. I experienced six teachers and I choose this one. In conclusion, I recommend for all my friends. If you can't, I'm just sorry. By the way, she is very beautiful. Thank you very much. I am not sure how to pick special for BBC News. So you will get information about the Good morning. Now I will give you brief information about the weather in Tashkent. In the first half of the day, there will be around any precipitation, the speed of wind 6-7 meters second. In the second half of the day, it is predicted to rain in the storm. The temperature drinks will be around 3-5 degrees cold. I am ready to submit my special for BBC News. A whole bag of Doritos just because your fish died? <laughs> Here, boy, I won't hurt you. <laughs> Are you sharing those Doritos like I asked you to? She's okay! You want to get a good job, or you want to study abroad anyway, you want to enhance some job. Am I right? But you can speak in English, or you can not speak in Russian very well. Okay, what are you waiting for? Don't go so far. Your dreams are here. Target. Just join us in the in your dreams. Contact right now, please. Good morning. Holidays are good, especially if they are national ones. However, some holidays, which are celebrated widely among young stars, are even against for our religion. That is Valentine's Day on February 14. Also this day, our great poet and author Zahid Adun Muhammad Babur was born. Now we will make questionnaire among young people how they know that day. Excuse me, can you tell me what date is on February 14th? Hello, my name is Madonna. I think it is the day of worse. I mean Valentine's Day. 
Day. That day, uh, everyone will be threatened to their partners. You know that day, you can see a lot of boys with red floors in the street. It is really amazing for uh, ama amazing ro and romantic boys in the city. It that is birthday of a fourth bubble of Algeria. Thank you. Goodbye. Excuse me, can you tell me what date it is on February 14th? Mm. Thank you. It is the birthday of one of of great poets and author Zahir Muhammad Babur. Moreover, it is con considered uh, as a holiday of, of law, but I think it is, it is prohibited to collaborate the day begging our country uh, as it is not appropriate, uh, appropriate to our culture. Thank you. I'm Huda Kulova Charasman for BBC News. Good morning, Miss Thomas. Our studio in the conference is the global students are with the football game between Barcelona and Real Madrid. We can call that game as an El Clasico with a big score of proof of Madrid won the Barcelona 4 2 1. Uh, if talk about the local sport, last week uh, I but but the Patent Republic Championship and Dysar's place. Thank you, special for the business. That's all for now. Thank you your audition. Have a good day, goodbye. Thank you. 